V? That you? Shit. I thought you were... gone. You're not alone in thinking me dead. I thought it was game over for me, too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. What's your thought, okay? You heard about the heist, I think. Must have, uh, talked to Evelyn. Like Didn't need to. Whole damn city's hurt. Listen. Need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? what I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? <laughs> Got a good memory for faces. We're closed right now. I'm uh, looking for Evelyn Parker. You know where I might find her? Used to come around. Haven't seen her in a while, though. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let you do it. Whoa, whoa, start again. What is it you want us to do now? Beat some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know. So you you let it. I don't, I don't care. care. I just, I just want, want my room back. back. Your pimp threw you, you out, out, that it? Told me I was generating losses, then just said, just have, have a nice, nice life, life and slam the, the damn, damn door. door. I don't, I don't got, got nowhere to sleep tonight. tonight. Still got, got your body, body though, don't you? Work it. Don't think I do. Every any I make gets eaten up by upgrades. So I said, fuck it. Got a doll chip. Went to clouds, said they weren't hiring no more. Now I gotta work the streets to pay back my Ripper dog. Doll chip's not all you got from the look of things. Faceplates high design, custom made. Wow, tits too. I invest in myself. Still wasn't good enough. Still told me I was underqualified. Oh, but what are we supposed to do about it? I told you, want my room back. That's all. That ain't how this works, honey. If you were a mox, this would be a whole nother combo. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. You're done with that bathroom? Yep. Back to the bathroom grind. Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. What the hell am I supposed to do with them all? I don't. You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Suze, we're not done here. Oh, yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that... What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the Mox? Moxes and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community. Solidarity. Classic dilemma. What comes first? Family or the outside this world? Is a club. 
Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on it. It wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. Luxurious. Wait. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay? I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. I have a tiger, babe. That's Susie for you, showing peeps. Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? I'm truly honored to meet you. If you've got any biz, call me. on everything. And I sold twice more stock than usual. So, you broke even? Yes, but the goods were trash. I would have thrown them away. That was fucking rhetorical. The Stan's Tiger Claws. You're about to know my rep. It's a beautiful day, huh? The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. If I miss this time, enlighten me. 
brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Our sock and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corps leave it to the gang. Suits collars and get soiled. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, Especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. Someone's in a great mood. Not every day a half-brain dead dude drags me around a cat house on a wild horde chase. So having a grand old time. You think Judy's lying? Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was, you're full of shit. Got it. Arasaka, the finest of the person you know. what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure, you never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire, we find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled, and maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. Looking for Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. I need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Check in, please. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their guards close, fine. We'll play our own game. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now 
bear with me a moment? Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Interesting. Is that normal, or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? I'd rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go in your dick, Johnny. We hope you enjoy your stay. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Welp, looks like this'll be interesting. So, V. You're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside. You fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. There's something in those mirrors. Way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Look for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Just answer my question. Tell me where Evelyn is. Don't have time for a debate. Why the manager say she doesn't work here anymore? When was Evelyn last here? You know anything. Evelyn had her own story before it collided with yours. But I know you'll find her. You always get your way. You're just gonna talk in circles? That it? I can't help you if you don't want to be helped. What's next? Meditation? Something like that. Try me. Think you know me well? Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. Had a true friend once. Now he's gone. Soon I'll be gone too. Except 
Won't have anyone by my side. Everything you need, you already carry inside you. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? It wasn't so long ago I really wanted that. But then all this shit happened. Seems like I was living in a dreamland. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased. As if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different. Death is death is death. You're gone, game over. You can't know that for certain, even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it, and it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since, or for what's to come. What's past is past. I'm over it. You're in denial, don't you see? Would it change things even by a hair if I wasn't? So what now? Now... You find out what it is you need to do. Which is... You're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City, knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have. Emergency break. Rip me out just to talk? What happened? Did I do something wrong? A lot of things been going on in my head lately. This was... different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. I just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out. And maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. 
Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody would care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. A customer attacked her? I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Where did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Gonna just stand there or tell me a number. Eleven. This booth occupied now? Nah. I think it's been out of order since... Um... Need to get inside that booth somehow. Yeah? And do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Who's Tom? A doll. Like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth 2. I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Let's take a look, shall we? Blood. Fresh. Not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. the handle. Something bitter in the ass. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. And that runner? Weird. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? There a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you out.
Better keep this short and sweet. Oh, I see. Well, Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much. Well, Even yeah. for me. I have that bike. Hard I day. know it. More like hard life. This place always this dead? Thought I heard a tumbleweed roll by. Dead for you. Lively for others. For me? Just right. What can I get you? Got a house special? I'll take it. What do you mean, exactly? Top shelf. Looking to put the edge on, not take it off. It depends what you like. Go with your gut. Surprise me. gone wrong here not really sure uh don't have your details sorry no idea what i'm supposed to do relax you don't need any data don't need any deets i'm not a customer I'm here to talk to you specifically not to be with a doll tom is that it uh-huh i need to get in touch with evelyn parker it's important you and me both. Try calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Which was it? Osaka or Oslo? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. That accident. Involved the client, did it? Found blood in her booth. Ah, uh, You know, shit like that happens here sometimes. And everyone's cool with that. We get new implants, recovery leave, and, well, sometimes even a payout. Now that I think about it, it is weird she went away so far. 
Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Oh yeah, I'm good. Got some new hardware. Could it be Woodman what finally shed that? some light on this shit show? Has a motor and uh, can only dream. Can we? The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh, that's what they should be replacing. Well, that's the whole point. They're not supposed to remember. Not. Shobo? He's one of the tea claws. Yager, a fucking psycho. He likes to hurt people. The bombs have him on the flat list. Some girls marked him for death. That's all pretty good. My blacklist is right. The mock's blacklist is well, that's the whole point. It actually means. Hold it there, honey. You seem to be in the wrong place. Hey, no peeking. Bad luck sings like this. Looks familiar. What's that? Evelyn's jacket. It's crumpled like a tissue. It must have been here a while. Tiger Claw's moonlight is peeping toms. They always got eyes in their dolls. Know what goes on in these booths. Then, data mine the behavioral chips. Saw that twist coming a mile away. Had a hunch. Still, wonder if it's for their own use or for sale. And who'd be buying? Bouncer schedule.
Something spooked him. Right there, see that? Two way in, they hauled every last security man to the club. Now I remember why I never wanted kids. Leave it. It's junk. Looks like they called Tiger Claws for backup, too. Allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would you? As you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Nah, you can do better. Try Roxy over at Booth, too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. I know you guys got hit by a runner a while back. I can make sure that never happens again. That's so. Uh, let's hear it then. Tit for tat. Want to be net secure? You're gonna help me find Evelyn first. That's the only way this is gonna work. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker? She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. Evelyn stopped pulling profit. No denying that, sadly for her. I saw what she did to the client. Did she get spiked or something? Whatever or whoever fried her circuits, it came from outside our submit. They played their deck like a virtuoso. Her chip was fucking rot. Believe you me, we tried to fix it. Didn't even come close. They common? These kind of accidents? Ever use tech that never broke? Didn't think so. Behavioral chip splits you right down the middle. Some people plain lose their minds. And for everyone that does, there's a dozen in line to replace them. Is this you talking about straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high. To recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, he said he knew something or other. You took her to the ripper instead of following orders. Didn't take you for someone with balls. For fuck's sake, I'm not running a slaughterhouse here. I only recycle as a last resort. And family always gets a call. If there is any. Think there are any daddies out there willing to change the diapers of a brain-dead little slut on the verge of cyberpsychosis? Probably not. Casting him out on the street ain't an option either. Can't risk tanking our crib. Well, anything's better than a bullet to the brain. <laughs> you know, that's what every doll says. 
I'm starting to like you. You looking for work by any chance? You invested your own eddies to help poor, unprofitable Evelyn. Please. <laughs> you got me. Ripper's the one who paid me. For a broken doll. People got all kinds of kinks. Trust me. I know. Considering where I work. Fingers is a real specimen, though. Got all the fetishes. Even the ones you've never heard of. I'm sure he found her a nice niche. <laughs> the Ripper. Name and address. Don't know her last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. It goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. Now, you do your end. How do we board up against hacks? You need soft to isolate chip and implant receptor layers from Cloud's subnet. At the same time, it'll keep track of and block any attempts to modify the core on the go. Ah. Uh, now in human rather than machine. You need Smart Eye, latest version. Smart Eye. Got it. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. The quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream. Pleasant day to you. The next time you have that... Urge for Cloud? Don't wait. So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting? Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but... That... Got a real charm, this place. In that slimy, subterranean kind of way. That's the infidelity. Oh, no. Think Fingers got her? I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. See, your opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed. Oh, but it has. Experience all of Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking of fire to really make this place shine. Now you're flat. 
Don't look in any condition to find help. You'll be soft. Oh, fuck! What the hell's that? No, 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 damn it. Damn it. Jesus, what the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. <laughs> but why? Fighting for some dated ideal? Pursuing a personal vendetta? You don't need to know. Here to get me from point A to point B. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so, this Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now. Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now. We got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. You called. <laughs> Promise I called, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock, goes by fingers. Oh shit. Know where to find this fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop off Jig Jig Street. Fuck V. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now. To find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Uh, all right, later, V.
Where's your cute little ass rushing off to? Years of practice. Slow down. Treat yourself to a little R E L A X X X. Can you bend like she can? Here, kitty, kitty, what's the rush? They chipped you for free? Fuck off! Yeah? Gear looks a little basic, but it works. So he didn't ask for any money? Nada? Not even stone? Like I said, he just finished and said, oh, see you next time. Hey, not one step closer. Here to see who. Looking for a ripper doc. Goes by fingers. Know where I can find him? Who's asking? And why? Got a problem with an implant. Not from around here. Couldn't find another ripper in the city to patch you up? Red Fingers was the best. Yeah, the best for joy girls. Are you a whore? An escort. For special tastes. Looking for a ripper who can cater to my special needs. Good. Fingers will like you. Let him through. Oh, gracious creature! And benign! What the hell are they taking? Blue the world. With, with, with Probably Bloody shame! It's brood! If they were friends of King, I'm all we own! During the third quarter. I'm prayer to him! Shut up! Twenty-four hours. Peace. Feel no Arise. pain. Bear Sounds like paradise. Who can blame him then? Hey, you all right? No way I'm gonna swim! I hate water! Can't you see nobody cares? Fingers. Know where I can find them? If I could, I'd swap, you know? Why does everything have to be so damn convoluted? In the end, only I got left the shredded cables and empty bottles. Everyone's got their brain. Hello, there's a line. Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Fingers guy, you know him? Heard some things, yeah. Like. His hand sometimes slips. Glad to see a familiar face. I'm worried sick about her. He has no idea anything had happened. We'll find her. I know we will. After the heist, Evelyn hold up with the mocks for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell she go back to Clouds? <laughs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get in to see than the best docs in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. I think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere. 
On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God, no. Because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. She means a lot to you, doesn't she? And you've arrived at that conclusion how, exactly? The moment you knew where she was, you sprang into action. Once you get close to Evelyn, you never want to let her go. You worked at Clouds. Not as a doll. Tuned their virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew. You see a woman with blue hair around here? Had a doll chip. Uh, think I know who you're talking about. Fingers worked on her, sure. She's still here? No idea. Gotta ask him. My friend here, she's in real sorry shape. You couldn't let us cut in front just this once. Uh, uh. Of course. Honey, be my guest. Well, now, hold on. Hold on a sec. Didn't seem so bad just a minute ago. She's a toughie. Keeps it inside, mostly. Now try Come on, let's go. Lips of yours. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. How about now? Better. Wait, something's wrong. Can't see nothing but a blur. Faceplate's previous owner had a longer face than you. Edges are stretching your optic nerve. Don't worry. Your eyes are dust. We going in? Eventually. Yes? Hello. What can I do for you? Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. I know she was here in your clinic. Ah. So that's what this is about. Where is she? Ah, a loaded question if I've ever heard one. You, Tiger Claws? As far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? I used to ride in nomads, resourceful folk. Wouldn't cast anything aside until it was worn down, dead, couldn't be fixed or reused in some other way. But what you're giving these girls, not even nomads would touch that. Please, let's not exaggerate. I give them what I can. You looking for a friend? <laughs> Heard you help the working girls around here. Well, very few children will play with broken toys. So when skin goes flabby, sockets go out of whack, implants malfunction, I'm sure you get the gist. Pay for goods, you expect top quality. Consumerism 101. Please, scrapyards offer better quality than this. These girls know you're chipping faulty implants? You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick fuck. Know that? You're looking for a friend? <laughs> Already told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. I'll be more than glad to show you around. But, um, uh, later, perhaps. Went jittery soon as I mentioned her name. Don't try getting out of this. I know you remember her. I, I have a neurological condition. It's not easy living with ticks. Really, I'd love to help, but if only I knew who you were talking about.
What about your logs? You gotta have some kind of record. Tech like this, you don't register. Don't put any names down for it. Blue hair, doll chip, best brain dance gear ever, though damaged. Was she here? Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. You mentioned you couldn't help her. Help her with what, exactly? If I only knew, I wager she'd be standing here, happy and smiling. Instruction register on her chip was burnt to a crisp. Tried replacing it. Nothing. Damage was caused by a netrunner using homebrewed malware. Sounds about right. Get to the point. The point? Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible to have a conversation with her around. Don't talk to her like that. She insulted me! Look, the quicker you spill, the shorter you'll have to put up with us. Now, Evelyn Parker, where is she? Could very well be on her way to becoming the next underground brain dance, darling. That's all I know. You sure about this? Four days I had her here. She was out cold in La La Land for practically every minute. It wasn't a slumber party. We didn't have pillow fights and promised to send each other postcards. What do you mean by underground? I don't know. I mean, I don't watch that sort of stuff. Snuff? XBDs? I told you I don't know. Where will we find her? How many times do I have to repeat myself? I, I don't know. I, I did what anyone in my place would do. When I realized I wouldn't be able to help her, patch her up, I called my fixer. Two guys came and picked her up the same day. Who'd you call? Who's your fixer? With Kako. Told her I had a busted doll with a BD implant to hand off. Where did they take her? I told you already. I don't know. They weren't the talkative kind, and I'm no gunk. I know better than to ask questions of people like that. You're no gunk? What do you think? Why'd all these girls come in here, let you grope around them? Think it's for your charm? Your caring attitude? They do it because they got no choice. And in the end... They despise you. They can smell you pathetic. These guys, what do they look like? Like you, me, anyone else in this city. Really now? They look like you? They look like the kind of guys you don't make eye contact with. One of them was a bearded fellow. The two that came for her didn't say anything about where they were going to take her, what they were going to do to her. Mentioned something about virtues with... A moth, of all things. Said she'd be perfect for them, whatever that means. But that's really all I know. You ponder off like she was some fucking inanimate mannequin. Because that's exactly what she was. Need air. I'll be outside. Judy's right. People like you make this city a living hell. Day in, day out. Got what you wanted, didn't you? So get the fuck out of here!
I let her go back to clouds. I could have stopped her, but I didn't. Trust me, Judy. Compared to the pieces of shit I scrape off my shoe every day, Fingers doesn't come close to being half their brand of rotten. Got no fucking words, V. None. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey, keep it together. You want to give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. It's better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Death's Head symbol bring anything to mind? Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. Makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. We need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leave something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. Has an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. Darknet domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. 